Inside the gateway? That we are. It was here that my quest first began. And you have been to that castle? Indeed. The princess had been spirited away, and I pledged my sword to her rescue. However, what awaited us... Remember me. You were lucky enough to defeat me once. Garland, how did I know you would be here? Interesting. I could say the same thing to you. Fate seems set on having us cross swords evermore. Even though we are no longer bound by time, we are still bound by destiny to fight! Cecil, Noctis, let us oblige him. <laughs> You're the boss. <laughs> How will you fare against armed opponents? I'll admit you have the courage, but have you the wits? with your almighty bolts! Not a failure. <laughs> you owe me an answer. Is Spiritus the one sapping this world's life force? Nonsense. He is a successor of the old gods and deeply bound to this place. He desires not its destruction. If he speaks true, then we are only wasting our efforts. You're correct. We must return at once and apprise Materia um, of- Um, hold up. Uh, huh? Uh, so, um, well, we don't have to go all the way back there. What do you mean? Remember how Materia and Spiritus could communicate in real time back at her dome? Could just use whatever they did, not like Spiritus will attack us. All we gotta do is ask. It'll save us time, I'm sure of it. That may work, if Spiritus will let us. Hmm. He is not so single-minded as to let a petty view cloud his better judgment. Then our next destination has been decided. That was an ingenious solution, Noctis. No problem. Uh, just 
one thing. Hmm? How about you call me Noct instead? It's no use. We're just going around in circles. Let's sit here. We can wait for help. You know darn well where we are. No one's ever gonna drop by. Huh? Oh. Ah! Uh. Why did that infernal gateway have to open and lead me astray? On an excursion? What a quaint diversion. Uh, uh, <laughs> you're in high spirits, all things considered. Think you can get us back to Materia? Oh. If not, who would I be? A peon without pedigree. <laughs> Thank the stars! Looks like it's our lucky day. Just one question. Who is she? An ally. She knows her way around this place. Enough to escape. We should hurry. Gotta see how things are. along with this world. Not even your name shall survive my wrath. You're not coming? Uh... Should take a look around first. All right. Well, see you around. Yeah. See you later. <laughs> Show me the ropes around here, little one. If you would but look around, you would see there is no need for that. Would it have been anywhere else? Excuse me, but we have something to... What the heck? Hear us out, please! We mean you no harm! Can't get near him! <laughs> Perhaps it was a mistake for me to come here. What? Sadly, my presence here only nettles him. 
You wish. Get over yourself. This isn't like back home. Why else would the Moogles guide us here? Koja, do you know how to calm him down? Your naivete is refreshing, if nothing else. Don't be absurd. Hmm. Such a being will never obey reason. Yet another trial? Good thing my blades are sharp. Only the tritest of twists for this play. I'm looking forward to fighting on your side next time. You saved our butts. <laughs> Mere coincidence. Alexander was my goal. Don't just stand there. This place will soon be reduced to nothing. How typical. Kuja, don't be a stranger. Okay. We need a split. <laughs> heading back as well you too yeah we just finished up with a job a job ta-da summons and stuff <laughs> I imagine felling beings much like the primals was harrowing it was no sweat and you I had a great time there was danger around every corner this isn't some field trip, Vaughn. It's serious. Uh, well, we found out a lot, too. Apparently, Plains Gorgers are running amok all over. Aye, and have wrought much destruction. They sup on the force we seek to amass, threatening this world's balance. It could founder ere long. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> uh, hey, listen up. This is important. <sighs> 
but not enough for Squall? If that's how it is, we'll need to change our priorities. Just so everyone knows, Materia and Spiritus were created from Cosmos's desire to keep this world safe. Huh? Uh huh? I also want to make sure this world is safe. Lots has happened to me here. Maybe not all of it good, but that doesn't make this place any less important. <laughs> Without this world, we couldn't see each other anymore. I don't want that. Plus, we barely know anything about each other's homeworlds. <laughs> to arms, then. This land has suffered the presence of these voracious dragons over long. <laughs> So you're the famous Materia. Pleased to meet you. I had heard tell of a lost warrior, and was quite taken aback. Thankfully, you managed to find your way to my side, hale and hearty. Before you celebrate, I've got some bad news. <sighs> Although your journey began some time ago, the world's heart now beats faintly as ever. Mayhap Spiritus' minions proved overly formidable? No, not quite. If only! Some things are guzzling down our energy for themselves, the same ones that were doing it before! If you know the cause of our ails, then why not excise it? Powerful than us, your ignorance puts me to a non plus. Yes! Oh. Don't waste the last drops of our precious time gawking. The situation demands we begin talking. <laughs> gawking? Was I gawking? Huh? What are you asking me for? Do you mean to turn my champions against me? Save your quarrelsome posturing for another time, Materia. As even fragments of the beast take this form, our travails will persist until we kill it outright. Seems like wherever we go, there they are. Our path's home are blocked as long as it draws breath. Another reason it deserves a quick death. Did you know of this, Spiritus? Did you stand idly by, while the world's lifeblood was siphoned away? I knew as little as you, and there is no shame in that. If we are to grow, however, we must ensure that our world grows with us. Very well. Then I have a request. Warriors of distant worlds, lend us your strength and your skill. Pull this realm out from the mire of combat. The light will always be with us.
to cast off the chains that bind us to the cycle. We must make our stand! Our common enemy is none other than the Plane Scorcher. Whether we be gods or their champions... <laughs> What's gotten into him? We may have our differences, but in this world, we are one! <laughs> For the time being. Right. Don't think you're forgiven. This world is pretty cool after all. Let's meet up again, once things calm down. <sighs> it draws near. We must needs act with haste. Got it. Let's do this. <laughs> Nary a more capable band of champions exists. Of that, I harbor little doubt. Go forth. Prevail! Thank <laughs> you. 
savage beast deserves a savage end.
Huh? You had best not forget. Without my warriors, all hope of defeating Shinryu would have been lost. True. I swallowed my pride for this. And I never thought you would. I had no other choice. I simply employed the only means available. Do not embellish your own importance. What I did, I did for... The, the sake, sake of, of the, the world. world. <sighs> I have no qualms with that. The world must be restored, no matter the toll it is to take on us. Then, once it finally has... I will vanquish you. Hmm. Perfect. I expected no less from you. these be... memories? Parting gifts. <sighs> if so, I bequeath the vestiges of my power to each of you. Yes. Let us begin it all anew. Begin our own clash. Show me no mercy. Fret not, for you deserve none. I will have you bend the knee. It shall be your knee that bends, not mine. We grant you the service of our champions. To serve in your beck and call.